Valve imposes another ban wave targeted at Overplus users. Valve announced in its recent blog post that it rolled out a new cheat detection code a few weeks back and accumulated a list of cheaters since the rollout. With the new cheat detection code in action, Valve issued another ban wave, this time addressing the increased usage of third-party cheating and hacking apps. This new ban wave has been ruthless and several players, both casual ones and pros, have gotten banned. It should be noted that the Dota 2 community has been urging Valve to take action against the increasing number of cheaters and hackers in the game. Valve seems to have finally heard the cries of the Dota 2 community that was urging Valve to ban the use of third-party apps such as Overplus. The Overplus application allowed users to see details of other players before the drafting phase even began which would give the user an unfair advantage over non-user. With the help of this information, players could ban the enemy's most successful heroes or counterpick the heroes. Dota 2 community reacts to Valve's crackdown on cheating, hacking. The overall consensus in the Dota 2 community about the ban wave seems to be positive. Nigma Galaxy streamer Aloe Weha Omar who shed light on cheaters last month seems to be happy to see Valve taking action to make Dota 2's community better. He tweeted, A blessing from Valve. Pubs will be more bearable for a while now that Overplus is banned. Dota 2 statistician Ben Knoxville Steenowizen even laid out a list of banned pros and former pros on the first day of the automated ban wave. Hilariously, Yuroslav Limitless Parshin, who recently hit the 12k MMR milestone, was caught in this ban wave. However, not all cheaters have been affected by this ban wave. The issue of Overplus is just the tip of the iceberg. There's much more to be unraveled in the coming weeks.